Hi, this is Yvonne Galusha, and the purpose of this little video is to look at VBA resize. Now, this is not a very difficult command, and first I just want to kind of talk about how it works. So, you would use this if, as an alternative to like the Excel down, Excel to the right to select a range of data. And in this case, you count as like you would with cells. So you count where you are sitting and you basically in this situation go nine down and six across. So if we were to run that little video and we go back and look at the data, we can see starting at A2, we selected the student name and their scores. Now I'll start here by unselecting this. And I want to talk about a couple other things. So maybe we didn't know exactly how many rows. We didn't know the 9 and 6. So you could still do that. I'll comment out this approach by counting. See if we look up here, we count the number of rows using the columns count. And I'm sorry, we use count the columns, then count the rows. I'll get it right. And I'm subtracting one because we didn't want the header selected on the rows. And so then you're using the same resize command. The difference is now you're using the variables. I think you could have figured that out yourself. So I just wanted to point out that this is an alternative for selecting a range of data. The other thing I thought I would point out in this little video is to use debug. Now that we're going to get into more complex apps, that can come in very handy. So I'm going to run this version. We see if we, this selection is working correctly. And then also let's look at how this can be very helpful. This is an alternative to putting watches on. So run this. Look back at our data. And yes, we have the same amount selected. Let's come back here now. So where did this print out at? Well, you have to make sure the intermediate window is being made visible. So by doing that, I just made that visible. And now we can see I've run it a couple times. The number of columns was 6 and the number of rows was 9, which was the same thing we started with here when we were doing it hard-coded. So two things, just introducing you to alternative for selection using resize, and then the second thing to start perhaps using debug. Thank you.